In a stunning revelation that has left the scientific world astounded, the James Webb Space Telescope has captured something that challenges everything we thought we knew about the early universe. This isn't just a discovery, it's a disruption. What scientists have found is so unexpected, so monumental, that it is forcing astronomers and physicists to rewrite parts of our cosmic origin story. At the heart of this mystery lies an incredibly bright and massive celestial object, known only as Vir Rouge, a blazing, ancient red star that defies existing models of early star formation. Vir Rouge, which translates to, Red Truth, in French, is no ordinary star. It is ancient, so ancient, in fact, that it appears to have formed just 200 million years after the Big Bang. This makes it one of the oldest stars ever observed. The existence of such a star at this early stage of the universe's evolution raises many questions. According to our current understanding, the early universe was a dark and chaotic place. It was filled with hydrogen and helium but lacked heavier elements necessary to form massive stars. Yet, Vir Rouge seems to have formed and burned brightly in defiance of that assumption. The star emits a brilliant crimson hue, which is not just aesthetically captivating but scientifically profound. This coloration is due to the star's specific light spectrum, which reveals a unique composition of elements not typical for stars from that epoch. Its light has traveled for more than 13 billion years to reach us, carrying within it the chemical signatures and physical data that tell the story of a star born in the primordial chaos of the infant universe. Scientists used Webb's advanced infrared capabilities to peer through clouds of gas and dust, unveiling this enigmatic giant that had been hidden from view for eons. Vir Rouge is unusually massive, possibly hundreds of times the size of our sun. Its surface exhibits turbulent storms, swirling magnetic fields, and powerful stellar winds. These features would be impressive for a modern star, but for a star this old, they're downright perplexing. Normally, stars from the early universe, so-called Population 3 stars, are expected to be short-lived and composed almost entirely of hydrogen and helium. However, Vir Rouge contains traces of heavier elements such as carbon, oxygen, and even iron suggesting it had already undergone some form of nuclear synthesis or was formed in a region that had been previously enriched by another generation of stars. This contradicts the belief that the first stars were simple and lacked metallicity. If Vir Rouge contains metals, that implies it is not a first-generation star but a second or third-generation one. But that creates a temporal paradox, there shouldn't have been enough time for multiple generations of stars to be born, die, and enrich the cosmos with heavier elements by the time Vir Rouge formed. This means either our timeline of the early universe is flawed, or our understanding of how quickly stars could form, evolve, and explode into supernovae needs to be revised dramatically. Moreover, Vir Rouge doesn't exist in isolation. Around it, Webb has observed a complex structure resembling a primitive galaxy or a dense stellar nursery, filled with turbulent gas clouds and other ancient stars. This region seems to be undergoing intense gravitational interactions, as if stars are being slingshotted around by invisible forces. Some astronomers suspect a hidden black hole or an even more exotic object may be influencing the gravitational landscape. If a supermassive black hole existed in such an early stage of the universe, it would further disrupt our theories, since it would require matter to collapse and accrete into a massive object far faster than current models allow. As researchers dug deeper into the spectral data from Vir Rouge, they uncovered anomalies that couldn't be ignored. The star appears to pulse with a rhythm that doesn't align with known stellar cycles. These fluctuations in brightness suggest something more complex is happening, possibly interactions with a binary companion or internal processes never before observed. Some fringe theorists have even proposed that the pulsing could be a natural code or pattern related to the star's formation in a universe governed by laws we do not yet understand. Interestingly, Vir Rouge's location also adds to the intrigue. It is positioned on the edge of what some scientists believe to be a void or cold spot in the cosmic microwave background, a region where the energy density of the universe appears abnormally low. This could be a coincidence, or it could mean that Vir Rouge formed in a unique environment that somehow accelerated its evolution. 
Some theorists speculate that these cold spots might be the result of early interactions with other universes, remnants of a pre-Big Bang structure, or even scars left by dark energy turbulence. The implications of this discovery are vast. If Vir Rouge is indeed older and more complex than any known star, it suggests that the processes shaping the cosmos began earlier and moved faster than we imagine. This could mean the universe is far more dynamic and chaotic in its infancy than our textbooks have suggested. It may also point toward the existence of structures or forces, like dark matter filaments or early quantum fluctuations, that catalyzed the rapid formation of stars and galaxies. Already, debates are raging across the astrophysics community. Some experts argue that Vir Rouge is a fluke, a rare statistical outlier that doesn't invalidate our models. Others see it as the first crack in a cosmic dam, suggesting that many more such ancient and massive stars could be waiting to be discovered. If Vir Rouge is just one of many, we may have to rethink the entire timeline of the early universe, including when galaxies formed, when the first black holes appeared, and how the large-scale structure of the universe took shape. But perhaps the most haunting aspect of the discovery lies not in the data, but in the silence. As scientists point the James Webb Telescope back toward Vir Rouge to gather more information, they've noticed something strange. The star's light, once steady and vibrant, is beginning to fade. This could indicate that the star is nearing the end of its life, or worse, that it was already dying when we first saw it and the light we observe is merely a cosmic echo from a star that no longer exists. It's a sobering reminder of the temporal distance between us and the events we study in space. The objects we see are often long gone, their light a ghostly memory traveling across time. Adding to the mystery, a set of data anomalies were detected around Vir Rouge by AI systems monitoring the telescope's feed. These anomalies included patterns in the star's pulsations and surrounding gas movements that some systems flagged as non-random. While most scientists attribute this to natural variability or instrumental noise, a small faction of researchers is considering more speculative interpretations. Could Vir Rouge be interacting with something entirely outside our known physical laws? While mainstream science remains cautious, the James Webb Space Telescope team has confirmed that follow-up observations are scheduled over the coming months. These will use not only the Webb's primary instruments but also support from ground-based observatories and even gravitational wave detectors, in case Vir Rouge is part of a much larger cosmic event. The goal is to determine whether this star is a unique object or a harbinger of more discoveries that will shatter our understanding of cosmic history. There's also growing interest from the field of theoretical physics. Some have proposed that Vir Rouge could be evidence of a phase transition in the early universe, a moment when physical laws briefly changed, allowing stars like it to form under completely different conditions. This is tied to theories of cosmic inflation and multiverse hypotheses, which suggest that different parts of the universe could operate under different physical constants. If Vir Rouge formed in such a region, it could be the first observational clue that the universe is not homogeneous, and that other cosmic neighborhoods may be stranger than we ever imagined. Despite all this, Vir Rouge is just one star. It glows alone in a distant part of the cosmos, sending its story to us across billions of years. Yet within that light is a tale that challenges everything we thought we knew, from the origin of stars to the behavior of the universe itself. As the James Webb Telescope continues its mission, scientists hope that Vir Rouge will be the first of many secrets the early universe is ready to reveal. For now, all we can do is watch, wonder, and prepare for the possibility that we've only scratched the surface of a cosmic truth far deeper and more complex than we ever dared to believe.